Life Park uh, this afternoon. Tyler Skaggs was found dead in his hotel room, passing away at the age of 27. And the only word I can use right now is shock as we stare up to the heavens. And uh, can only hope that Tyler is, is looking down upon us here today um, as we welcome you inside the broadcast. Picture Tyler Skaggs has died at the age of 27. We have no further details to provide at this point. We do have this statement from the angels. It is with great sorrow that we report Tyler Skaggs passed away earlier today in Texas. Tyler has and always will be an important part of the angels family. Our thoughts and prayers are with his wife Carly and his entire family during this devastating time. There are no other details at this time. Please keep Tyler's family in your thoughts and prayers. We could have members of the media with the team as, as members of the team, almost as teammates. And he always was available. He touched so many hearts in and out of baseball, his hospital visit, and anywhere you needed him, he was there. Uh, but this is truly painful because having gone through this with the mid eight hour situation, you know, 10 years ago, it brings back so many memories, a lot of pain, but uh, certainly I, I, I am blessed that I got to meet number 45, Tyler Skaggs. His big league debut, Mark Grace, and we're talking about the lefty Tyler Skaggs.
him out. Curveball gets him a pair of strikeouts here in the inning. Three two. Guzman, their big first baseman, and he waves it down and misses it. Runner breaks for second. Strikes out the side. He's got four punch outs. Four consecutive strikeouts, one out. Hit towards second, off the bound, right to Kinsler. Feeds Fontana. But that four six three. Double play with an assist to the mound. Breaking ball down goes to Scotty. Gets him down. He wanted that breaking ball down. Got it. Brad had a very serious conversation. I mean, he, he expects a lot out of me. He wants to be, he thinks I could be an all-star, and I know I can be an all-star. And uh, he's, he's kind of putting a little fire underneath underneath my butt to, to go out there and perform the way that everybody knows that I can. And um, I appreciate that, honestly. I mean, I want a manager who's going to push me, who's going to lead me in another inning longer to prove that, you know, I, I can be the guy. So.
for your mom's been a softball coach for over 20 years. What's the best piece of advice she's ever given you? Oh man, I mean, she's she's uh she's been huge and instrumental in me becoming a major league baseball player. Um, there's so many things she's helped me out with over the years, but um. You know, just when it comes to pitching, she always just tells me, you know, keep the weight over the rubber and keep your shoulder up. And uh, she knows me better than anybody else. I've had the same mechanics since I was seven years old. So I can even hear her at the game here. She's got that lot of voice. <laughs>